Hey yo, what's up guys? So welcome back to my channel to all my fellow YouTubers, friends and students and my little monsters. So I'm King Zion. I'm back again, your spray paint artist. So today we're going to create another spray paint art. So this spray painting we're going to use or create uh, flowers. So we're going to use stencils. So para po dun sa mga hindi pa nakakapanood sa mga previous videos ko at hindi pa po nakakapag-subscribe, please hit the thumbs up and smash the subscribe button. Thank you, I love you all, and let's go make some art. So yung gagawin po natin ngayon is one of my spray painting which is the spring flowers so of course ang una natin gagawin is yung background so pag gumagawa tayo ng spray painting syempre nagpo-focus muna tayo dun sa background bago dun sa mas maliliit na details syempre pag inuna natin yung small details may harapan na tayong gumawa ng background and also in create spray painting art so napaka halaga ng pasensya And also in this uh, spring field flower, uh, flowers na spray painting ko. So we're going to put three shades of green for the background. And also dito sa subject matter na to, so we are using stencils, scrumpled papers, and palette knife. So, instead kasi nagagamit tayo ng uh, pencils or markers, ang ginagamit dito sa spray painting is palette knife. So, ito yung nagbibigay ng 3D effects dun sa uh, paint natin. And also, the crumpled paper, bakit tayo gumagamit dito? Ito yung uh, nagbibigay, uh, nag-change ng texture dun sa spray paint art natin. And also, yung stencils, no? para to dun sa mga special subject matter na ginagawa natin so para maging maayos at maganda yung uh, lines sa paggawa natin ng uh, subject matter and also we are using black shade bago tayo gumamit ng palette knife and also crumpled papers dahil ito yung nagbibigay ng texture and bold lines dun sa ating art form. So, kung naaalala nyo yung gawa ni Henry Matisse sa modern art. So, dito yung ginagawa natin is contemporary art but we are combining the past techniques to the present techniques which is katulad nga ng modern art techniques ni Henry Matisse which is yung bold lines. Okay, so ngayon, sa so contemporary spray painting art, so ang ginagawa natin is gumagamit tayo ng uh, palette na yung pen crumpled papers to emphasize the bold lines. And then kaya tayo gumagamit ng stencils so para pa makapag-focus tayo dun sa uh, special and main subject matter natin at hindi ko malat yung uh, spray paint. And then after we use the stencils number 1, bago natin ilagay yung stencils number 2, number 3, number 4 kung meron, so gagamit muna tayo ng apoy. So ito yung ginagamit, ng, uh, ginagamit ko and then other uh, spray painters para mabilis matuyo yung spray paint at hindi dumikit dun sa stencils and also yung uh, 
apoy siya rin yung nagbibi- uh, nagsisild dun sa spray paint so para hindi siya mabilis masira at hindi siya mabilis mag fade So in this area, gagamit tayo ng sponge and brush para dun sa small details. So, minsan ito yung pinakamahirap na part kasi ito yung pinakamaliliit na detalye na gagawin natin. Ito rin yung pin- medyo matagal. Pero ito yung uh, nagpapaganda dun sa mismong mga art form. Yung mga small details. So pag nagawa natin ito ng maayos. And para po dun sa mga hindi pa nakapag-subscribe sa aking channel, please subscribe to Kay Design, hit the thumbs up and smash that subscribe button. Thank you and I love you all. Hey you guys, thank you again for watching. I hope you like it, I hope you enjoy it, and don't forget to smash the subscribe button and see you next time.